Hi, this is Brian. Welcome back to another micro class. This one's on sea turtles and your sleep. It's inspired by Don't Just Sit There by Katie Bowman. Sea turtles and sleep. What do they have to do with one another? Well, imagine you are a little baby turtle. That's a baby turtle, of course. And this is the ocean. And you were just born, right? Now, you back in the day would do something called sea finding, right? Where you would use the moonlight to guide you to the sea. You'd find the sea via natural moonlight. Now, what's interesting is Katie Bowman studied sea turtles in Cancun. And in Cancun, they installed all these huge hotels right on the beach that had huge bright lights at night. So these little sea turtles would be born and their evolutionary instinct was to follow the moon's light in order to find the sea, right? Well, these hotels are now there with all this artificial light and these poor little sea turtles can't figure out which way to go. They often struggle on the beach and die or they wind up in one of these hotel pools and die. They can no longer see find. The moral of the story is all animals are affected negatively by artificial night light. We've got to remember that the light bulb was invented in the 1800s it's been used heavily for less than 100 years. That is literally the blink of an eye in our evolutionary history, right? Boom, oops, we've now got light, right, that can keep us up at night, and it totally throws us off. Our circadian rhythms, as we talked about in Optimal Sleep 101, there are no more important biological rhythms that we want to attune to than our circadian rhythms. And almost all of us violate this to a really a horrific uh, extent. So if you are having trouble sleeping and your melatonin is getting disrupted by all the blue light from your little gadgets, from your iPhone to your pad to the huge computer or TV, turn them off at night if you're committed to feeling great the next morning. Remember your sea turtles an optimal sleep 101 and uh, come close to having a digital sunset or your equivalent. As I shared in the PNTV episode, I recently got a note from a, a member who took the class Optimal Living Sleep 101, and she had been getting up a couple nights, uh, a couple times every night for a long time, and she was a little bit hesitant to turn off all this electronic stuff, but she did so, and she slept through the night for the first time in forever. Sean Stevenson says that's this is the number one way to immediately boost your sleep. Simply turn off all this blue light emitting stuff, align more closely with circadian rhythms, and uh, like the sea turtles, without all this light, let your natural rhythms guide you to optimization in pursuit of actualization. There you go, sea turtles and sleep. What little thing can you do tonight to dial it in a little bit more? Hey guys, this is Brian. A lot of people don't know what I do beyond these YouTube videos I put up, so I thought I'd give you a quick tour of our membership platform. Uh, thousands of people have joined us already, 10 bucks a month, get access to a ton of stuff that's uh, in addition to what I put up on YouTube for free. So the basic idea is you just watched a micro class, hope you enjoyed that. I share, I just started doing these micro classes, but I now share over 50 of these per month. We've shared dozens so far. And it's basically a quick class on my absolute favorite stuff across the different domains of optimal living. Two to three, maybe five minute little micro classes on how to optimize your life. In addition to that, you get access to every single one of our philosopher's notes. We now have over 250 philosopher's notes on some really, really good books uh, a lot of them. In each one of them, you're familiar with the PNTV videos if you've watched many of those, but we also have PDFs and MP3s of our Philosopher's Notes. So here's, let's take a look at what a PDF looks like. This is an example of a Philosopher's Note. It's a six-page PDF where I basically share some of my favorite thoughts, riff on it, talk about how other teachers say the same things, and give you a nice playful kick in the butt to go out and apply the wisdom. That is a philosopher's note. I record that as an MP3 that you can download as well. And uh, 250 of those. I produce 10 of those at least 
per month that I share with you in addition to the micro classes. And then you also get access to all of our old classes. We have the five day immersion reboot, habits 101, confidence 101, getting stuff done 101, meditation 101, and then future classes including Relationships 101, Energy 101, Purpose 101, Biz 101, Goals 101, etc. So there you go. Uh, really blessed to have some extraordinary support. And I will share with you where you go to sign up. I'll put a link to this. But basically, cruise on over here. You can sign up. And this is the kind of response we've gotten so far um, from our members it's pretty neat. I've made more positive changes in my life, my brief membership, only three months so far than I did through years of counseling. Yes, Brian Johnson, you are a rock star. Thank you very much. That's very kind of you. And I'm making huge strides in optimizing my life as a result of your philosopher's notes and optimal living classes. I spend $19 a month on my gym membership to take care of my body. A mere $10 a month on an optimal living membership is the biggest value and best investment I've ever made in my emotional, mental, and spiritual health. Thank you for the incredible work you're doing to inspire us to be rock stars in our own lives unbelievably inspiring and humbling. Um, in 24 hours, we received hundreds of uh, extraordinary notes um, from members around the world. So there you go. That's a quick look at what we're up to, 10 bucks a month. Hope to astonish you. There you go.